This is the Bear Grylls Ultimate Pro Fix Blade. It comes with an integrated pull-through carbide sharpener, a belt loop for carry, and a slim pocket to keep the priorities of survival close at all times. It also features a fire steel for use with the top of the blade to create sparks. It fits securely, vertically, back in the sheath. It has a full fine edge blade made of 9 CR19 MOV steel and full tank construction for extra durability. It includes a built-in pommel for hammering and pounding, a whistle in case you need to signal for help, and two holes to lash it to a stick to create a spear. We took the best-selling survival knife in the world and made it better. This is the Bear Grylls Ultimate Pro Fix Blade from Gerber. This is the strong arm fine edge fixed blade knife. It features full tang construction with a 420 high carbon fine edge blade for strength and durability. It's coated in black ceramic for low profile use and corrosion resistance. The knife's handle has a rubber overmold engineered with a diamond texture for superior grip in all conditions. The modular sheath has snapped together components that allow you to mount the knife in multiple ways using molly or vertically or horizontally on a standard tactical belt. Proudly built in Portland, Oregon, this is the strong arm fixed blade knife. All right, I want to talk about the Gerber LMF2. It's a multi-purpose knife designed for tough operations. I'm going to go through the knife here. Cutting surface. We've got a serrated surface for cutting seat belts. And the handle's insulated against the shock an electrical circus. We've got a butt right here can be used as a hammer and you've got a point right there that can be used to break glass. This is a simple knife, uh, effective stout tool. It can be used to be a permanent place in my gear. things that that's I think is obviously a very big trend and what's really accelerated the popularity of knives is is the one hand opener and most certainly those are the great tools that's what I carry every day um, it's always part of me but when you're outside uh, and you're working I have a workshop when I'm there I don't know it's just too much trouble to always have to you know, I have a small piece of land so when you're outside working 
It's always nice to have, quite frankly, a fixed blade. And you don't need a wimpy one. <laughs> this is not a wimpy knife. And I think that what I appreciate with Buck is that you've got something that you can hold on and you know you got a hold of something. And I, I think that there's a, a lack of real appreciation for a good fixed blade, thinking, well, that's a hunting knife. No, this is a tool to be used when you just need to reach down, pull it out, and then reholster it. I think that that's lost in the appreciation of what a knife can do. And boy, what a sweet knife that is.